A new playground is rising at the Jersey Shore with a swell of emotion. It's going up in memory of Brendan Tevlin. He was a college student from New Jersey who was murdered by a convicted terrorist four years ago. NBC10 Jersey Shore Bureau reporter Ted Greenberg has the story. Piece by piece, they're building a new place to play and celebrating a life lost too soon. It's just amazing. It really is. It's just, it gets us through. Allison and Michael Tevlin on hand today as teams of volunteers started constructing a state-of-the-art playground along Barnegat Bay in Lavalette in memory of the couple's son, Brendan Tevlin. People will see his name and remember him and understand well, who was Brendan Tevlin. And, and understand what happened to Brendan. The 19-year-old college sophomore was randomly shot and killed in West Orange in 2014, ambushed in his car by convicted terrorist Ali Mohammed Brown, who was on a self-proclaimed jihad. It helps in the healing process. It's the 49th playground built in the U.S. and abroad by the Where Angels Play Foundation, many honoring victims of tragedy, including the Sandy Hook School Massacre. The nonprofit's founder has known Brendan Tevlin's grandfather through New Jersey's firefighting community for decades. Okay. Firefighters from throughout the state are working on this labor of love. He's family. When Brendan was killed, uh, it was a loss that we uh, all experienced very personally. So, unfortunately, the tragedy has come home. For Brendan's family, Lavalette is a very special place. His grandfather has a home here, and it's also where Brendan spent every summer of his life. He loved, loved Lavalette, loved surfing. This would certainly put a smile on his face, that's for sure. Yeah, 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 yeah. The playground will likely take a couple days to finish a ribbon cutting set for Sunday. For Brendan Tevlin's family, a sacred spot that they hope will bring joy and reflection. Ted Greenberg, NBC.